Do you sometimes squeak on every other note? Or are you not sure how to put your clarinet together and line all the pieces up correctly? Don't worry, with just a few tips, I can help you get started on the right track. So grab your instrument and get ready to follow along. Hi, I'm Sergeant First Class John Blair and welcome to the Virtual Music Classroom presented by the United States Army Field Band. We connect and inspire people throughout the country and around the world, and we're here to give you the tools you need to play your best, share your passion, and change lives. Let's get started. Ah, there's nothing like new clarinet smell. I remember putting together my first clarinet back in elementary school. I'll never forget looking at all the keys and wondering when I'll know enough notes to play a song. Look closely how all the pieces fit into the case. It's easy to bend keys or break pieces if you close the case the wrong way. Keep the logo on top and take your time. Use cork grease before you put the clarinet together for the first time and any time the pieces don't connect easily and smoothly. We'll work our way from the bottom up. Pick up the bell and the lower joint. It's the one with the thumb hook. These keys are made of metal, but they do bend if you're not careful. Hold the bell in one hand, resting it against your belly. Hold the lower joint in the other hand. Now push and twist from the top towards you into the bell until there is no space left between them. You'll know that it's right when the logo lines up with the keys. Next, take the upper joint, press the keys down, line it up, and press and twist in. Just make sure that the bridge keys are lined up on the side. And you're good. This is starting to look like a clarinet. Let's move on to the barrel and the mouthpiece. Take a moment to line up the logos between the barrel and the upper joint. Once that's on, take the mouthpiece without the ligature and twist it onto the barrel. Your clarinet is now assembled. It took me a while to get the hang of setting up my reeds on the mouthpiece. Take your time and it'll get easier with practice. First, I wet my reed while putting the instrument together. Once assembled, I slide the ligature over the mouthpiece like this. Now, we slide the reed down. Once the reed is in place, tighten the ligature screws. This takes a little bit of precision and practice. The best reed position is even on all sides. You'll know if the reed is right by playtesting. If this is your first time ever making a sound, congratulations. The right hand supports the instrument using your thumb under the hook. Left hand goes on top, your thumb goes over the tone hole and back, and your fingers over the keys like this. Now, bring the mouthpiece in at an angle and keep your chin up so you're looking straight ahead. When you're ready to play, keep your mouth sealed around the mouthpiece and your bottom lip rolled over your bottom teeth. In music, we call your mouth muscles the embouchure. We want a tight seal but don't bite, these reeds can be expensive. Blow into the mouthpiece one more time and you will play the note G. If you want to know where to put your fingers to play a song, take a look at this fingering chart. Before long, you'll be playing songs on your own like this. Now, all that's left for you to do is to start playing at home. Great job, everyone. Be sure to check out our other play-alongs and performance videos that feature the clarinet. Happy practicing. <laughs>